This procedure below can be used after a major cooling system repair or at any time you suspect there is air in the cooling system. This is best done when the engine is cool, like in the morning or after several hours of engine cooling. Please be careful if the engine is overheated. The basis of this method involves the installation of an aftermarket inline cooling hose filler and the upper 1.5 inch radiator hose. First, you remove the 17 mm bolt near the top of the thermostat housing and you also remove the radiator cap. Second, if the radiator hose is not full, then you have air in the system. If the hose is full, then your problem is elsewhere which is not in the scope of this video. Fill the radiator hose until the fluid starts to come out the 17 mm hole and then put the 17 mm bolt back in place for a few turns to stop the flow. Next, you fill the hose right to the very top and reinstall the radiator cap. Check the overflow reservoir fluid now and it should be about halfway up the reservoir. If you need to add fluid, remove the 17 mm bolt again and add fluid until the reservoir is at the correct level. If the reservoir is too full, then you need to drain some of the fluid to obtain the one half desired level. When the reservoir is at the correct level, tighten the 17 mm bolt and you're done. If you have done a major cooling repair, like replacing the timing belt and water pump, you will need to do this procedure several times.